and um, I'm going to be showing you the makeup to do and kind of the hairstyle you want for when you go out on the town at night. So, hope you enjoy and yeah! Hey guys, what's up? Um, it's Dylan here and today I'm going to be doing a um, uh, makeup tutorial and hair tutorial. Sorry, I can't see right now. Oh my gosh, that's better! It's me with glasses! Um, oh, tell me if you like this camera angle, because I've tried a new camera angle, and hopefully my phone doesn't fall right now. I'm really, like, kind of watching it and stuff. Um, but today I'm doing a... A makeup tutorial and sort of a hair tutorial for if you go out on the town alone or if you go out on a date or something um I don't know if I want to say this but I am currently and eh, I have my first boyfriend so yeah his name's Anthony right I uh I can tell you, I can make a whole nother video on how that all happens. So, maybe I'll make a new video. You guys tell me if you want me to. So, comment down below. Do you want to see a video about my first boyfriend? Yes. And please, if you go to my school and in, are in my grade and you know... Who Anthony is, do not tell a soul, or else I will be very sad, okay? Okay, so, yeah, all that, um, I don't know what I was going to say, but yes, uh, all that, <laughs> and, um, yeah, uh, so, let's get started, I guess. Sorry if I look like a mess, I have not been doing anything lately right now. I had to do homework because I'm currently in sixth grade. So exciting. Junior high. Okay, but let's get started. So I'm going to be taking off my glasses and I'm going to grab a um, headband so that your uh, hair doesn't get in the way, so yeah. And I don't know, how's you guys day? How's life? Um, are you guys in school? Uh, what grade are you guys in? Um, I don't know what else to say, but, okay. So now I'm going to take some foundation. I'm almost out of foundation, so I might take a little bit, try to, like, <clears throat> get it all out. But I have the, uh, sorry, my voice. Um, I have the Revlon Voto Read Airbrush. There you go. Can you read it? Boom, boom, boom. Okay, so, yes, I'm just going to take a kind of and I use my hands. I mean, maybe you guys don't, but I do. So, yeah. This is what I mean. Ah, there we go. My mom, when she first taught me how to, like, apply makeup, she's like, when you get foundation, you want about a walnut size. And I'm like, 
How big is a walnut? Anybody know? Why can't it be a peanut? Or any other kind of nut? Huh? 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 So yes, you're gonna just want to get your under eyes. I'm sorry if I don't get my under eyes really well. I'm not very good at getting my under eyes, but yet all that's really close to my eye. Okay. Please don't get foundation in the eyes. Foundation in the eyes stings really bad. It's not feel too well. So you're just going to want to rub it everywhere that you want. I wanted to cover my whole face. And sorry if this like is kind of paler than my skin. It um it used to be my mom's and then when I first tried out for one of my plays at school, I had no makeup to uh like I had no foundation or anything. So my mom just gave me some of her old stuff and she has much lighter skin than me. Um because she is like Polish, Romanian, all that other kind of neat stuff that I am also. Comment down below what um, heritage you are, what race. I mean, I'm Korean. That's how I get my tan skin. I mean, I'm not like super tan. Um, and I am Mexican, Italian. Uh, what other neat stuff am I? Uh, Korean, Italian, and Mexican I get from my dad. Uh, but like all this other stuff that I am comes from my mom's side because my mom's side has a lot of races in it. In fact, I, uh, it was like a couple months ago while I was stif still, la, la, la. Still in this grade, I uh, answered this uh, question or whatever, and it was like, "What race are you?" And it was like, oh, "What was it? It was um, it's like Mexican, Italian, and then I think it Chinese, and then um, Asian, <laughs> and then it said multi race, and I was like, definitely multi race, and stuff like that because it's like." Yes, I'm Mexican. Yes, I'm Italian. Yes, I'm, well, Korean, Korea is in Asia, but yes, I'm Asian and all this other stuff. And I'm just like multi race. Um, so, yeah, there's my life story. How about yours? Um, okay, so now I'm just, I got some new powder. It actually matches my skin tone. Yeah, okay, and it's the Cover Girl Ready Set Gorgeous. And yeah, it is much darker than my other foundation. Uh, if you can see that, I mean, yeah. But my other one was very pale and did not match my skin. So, yes, this actually matches my skin. It may not look like it on camera, but it does. It matches my skin very well. Um, if you have not noticed yet, but we are in a new uh, setting, environment, place. Yes, yes, we are currently not in my bathroom because I did not want to disturb my aunt. Uh, but I am in my mom's because she's out eating dinner and I'm with my aunt, but my aunt's in her room. And so, yeah. Um, my mom and her boyfriend are out to eat and I wasn't really hungry, so I just stayed behind. And I also wanted to stay behind because I wanted to make a video for you guys. And sorry, I'm not like, really up to a uh, date with making a video every single day. But as you know, I'm currently in sixth grade, so can't really have a lot of time to uh, make videos. So sorry. So if you know, um, air conditioning, ruining my video. Um, 
but if you like if i haven't been on for like maybe a couple days maybe a week you know why i'm at school doing homework for eight hours a day seven i don't know um but yeah and i'm also trying out for a musical so if i make it um i stay from eight in the morning to five at night rehearsing and then on top of that when i get home i have homework and it's really hard when you have a project so yeah uh i'm playing blush right now and yeah you apply blush <coughs> you apply blush where you wanna and yeah um uh, now i'm going to get my um eyeshadow so we'll see you back when i get that okay so i have my eyeshadow and it is the naked urban decay palette and then i am using the shade uh hustle and it is right there i was thinking of a darker shade so yes and just so you know i am doing eyeliner next and i am trying a new way of doing my eyeliner so i might have to pause so sorry about that because I don't want this to be a super long video and most of it being taken up by me just doing eyeliners. So yeah, I might like show you one eye and me not pausing it, but then again, that it depends on how long I take because this video is already 12 minutes long, but I am moving at a reasonable pace. So. Um, I don't know what to talk about. I mean, did I already ask what grade you guys are on? And comment down below what grade you are in. I don't know. I have, like, short-term memory while in sixth grade. The only good thing about sixth grade is you, uh, oh my god, I shadow in the eye. Okay. The only good thing, um, I mean, there's a lot of good things that, about sixth grade. But one of the good things is, so you switch classes and you have one, two, three periods in a day. Um, and yeah, you have your home, well, no, you have first period, which I've missed Burbank. Then you have second period, which I've missed Futrell. And then you have homeroom teacher, and she, I miss Hideaway. And then you have RTI. Don't ask me what RTI means. I don't know. Um... But yeah, and then you go to lunch, and then you go to social studies, science, and then you go to specials, which uh, are, are arts. Um, yeah, so we're at Arts Academy, so yeah, I'm in drama. Okay, so I am not using my eyeliner thing. I'm not going to waste time looking for it, but I'm using this small angled brush focus yeah that and I'm going to take this color from the uh, Naked 2 Urban Decay palette um, and I'm using blackout um, if you can't see it it's just a really dark black one so yeah um, I don't know if I have a certain technique of doing this but I know it's bad for your eyelid to hold it. Um, do this eye first. But I know it's bad for you to hold your eyelid while doing eyeliner. But I have to. Like, I learned this way, and now I have to do it this way. So, yeah. Don't comment and be like, Oh my god, Melanie, you're gonna ruin your eyelid. Well then, so be it. At least I'll be good at doing makeup. Okay, so now that you have 
So what you're gonna do is you're gonna do a straight line across your, the bottom of your, I, I am tearing up, gosh. Uh, you're gonna do a straight line right across the bottom of your eyelid. And then you're gonna do a little wing. Okay, I'm not the best at doing a wing. I just learned how to do a wing, so do not judge me. Um, but yeah, you're just gonna do wing and then There we go, there's my little wing. Okay, and I'm gonna pause since I already showed you how to do that. Um, so yeah, so you got my other eyes done. Okay, so my other eye, uh, oh, worst intro ever. My other eye is done, so yeah, there they are. Okay, so now you're gonna be doing mascara. And then I'm just gonna take an eyelash curler and you're gonna curl your eyes. Eyelashes do not curl your eyes. Oh, I caught my eyelid. Okay. Yes, yes. Class, 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 yes. Okay. Come on, eyelashes, curl. There we go. Okay. Okay, so let me go with my eyelash and my <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm very weird today. <sighs> okay, oh my god, I stop watering. Okay. Okay. <sighs> Alright. I'm going to be I'm going to be taking my lashaholic uh eyelash. Uh Mascara eyelash. Oh my god. Um, <laughs> it's just like shortened. Um, and yes, I'm going to be doing mascara. Poke myself in the eye. How many of you? Huh? How many of you guys? Every single time you do your mascara, poke yourself in the eye. Raise your hand. Okay. Okay. It's funny how you think I can see you. Um, but yeah. I do it almost every single time, and it's really annoying. And I don't know how to not do it, because I just always do it. And it's really annoying. And I really don't like it. Or, 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 this is a biggie. How many of you, when you're going like this, bump your nose? And you have a huge mascara mark. Mascara mark right in the middle of your nose. I don't do it every single time, which is a good thing, I guess, but I do do it most of the time. So, mascara is done. I like beautiful. Okay. Excuse me. Um, now you're going to be taking uh, mascara. <laughs> Lipstick. And I'm using this uh, uh, CC... Lipstick, and it is a darker shade. It is a darker shade. So yes, yes. Look at it. Look at it. Okay. So then, yeah, you're just gonna be doing this on your lips. So be right back. Okay. So I have lipstick on, and it looks beautiful. Okay. Sorry. So now you're gonna be taking out. So now you're gonna be taking off your headbands and you're gonna probably wanna grab a brush and just brush out your hair like you're a magical princess at the end of a long day of being a princess. <sighs> okay, sorry. But then you just wanna kinda grab it in front of you and just be like, hmm, what do I wanna do? So, what I'm going to do 
is something kind of messy, so it's kind of like fierce. Rawr. Okay, so sorry, sorry, sorry. Um, so what I do, I'm not gonna use any tools for this. You know what? I am not gonna promise that because I might if I change my mind. So what you can do is just kind of mess up your hair. Mmm, beautiful. You could even tease it in the back if you want to, but I don't want to waste time doing that. So yeah, you're just gonna like mm, mess it all up. Mmm, mess it all up. And or you could do something else and not follow my hair tutorial. But if you're really a weirdo and you have subscribed to become a weirdo, um, you might want to follow this. These steps that are very important and if you do it wrong, you might not look good. Okay? So that's you're gonna end up with something like this. And yes, your hair's gonna look kind of messy. And yes, your makeup is gonna look beautiful because you're gonna say Dylan Perrazzo on YouTube taught me how to do this. And you know what you're gonna do at the end of this video? You're gonna subscribe to be become a weirdo. <laughs> You're gonna subscribe to become a weirdo. Uh, follow me on Instagram at Janae underscore Perrazzo. J, that's J E N E E underscore Perrazzo. Same way it's spelled here. Uh, follow me on Vine at um, Dylan Perrazzo. Same way it's spelled here. And also chat with me on Kick. Uh, same way it's spelled on my Instagram. So that is Janae underscore Perrazzo. See you guys later in my next video. Yeah, 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 no.